Daisy looked happy playing basketball today. You know? Sometimes kids that come in with that kind of hype, it's almost like an obligation. Like, you know, everyone expects me to do this, so I hope I don't let anybody down. You know? Today she just like she she just looked like a happy kid playing playing a game she loves. Makes it look easy, doesn't she? I mean it's just it's like a machine, man. Uh, well, I don't know exactly how many games she's actually played in. Uh, you know, eight? Well, and of those eight, I don't know how many she actually played in. You know, she was in eight games, but there were a lot of games that she really didn't play. She didn't feel comfortable playing, and she wasn't herself. Today, I think, was the first game where she took it upon herself um, to be – present and you know the entire the entire game and you know we look we, we we look for her more we ran more stuff for her and um, she didn't pass up any she didn't pass up any shots you know she didn't she, she had a couple great passes she didn't turn the ball over um, if you had watched the game you would have thought she was an upperclassman playing out there that she was a senior so you know, eight games into her freshman career, you know, that was pretty good, huh? I think, you know, if that's the worst she ever looks, it's going to be pretty good. Well, as far as Caroline's concerned, you know, the last two games that we played, she, she took a couple pretty solid hits and, uh, you know, wasn't feeling really good yesterday and this morning when she woke up. So, cautionary, you know, it's best to best to keep her out. Uh, so, yeah, she has an upper body injury um, above her shoulders, and it's round. So <laughs> she, got smacked in the, she got smacked in the head two games in a row. And, um, you, know, you know, you do all the testing and everything. She doesn't have a concussion. But that's just because you don't have a concussion doesn't mean, you know, so I watched her practice a little bit yesterday, and I, I said, she's giving me a concussion. She's making me woozy. And she knew, she's not, she knew she wasn't ready. She knew she's not right. So a couple of days off will do, her, will do her great. She looks better every single day. And she was pissed, man. She wanted to play so bad. She was pissed. You know, I, I think they've tried to, to stay pretty positive uh, throughout all this. You know, it's been... Um, Obviously, very challenging, and um, you know they've had to roll with it, you know, in in a lot of different ways. Um, and, and there was a time, I think, when it was, um, are we, you know, are we going to ever see the other side of this, you know? But with each person that came back, you know, it just the feeling just got better and better. And today was probably the best where everyone, you know, and it's a shame we did it without Caroline. You know, so if we can, if we can get accomplished what we got accomplished today, knowing that, um, you know, Caroline and Paige weren't there to, to play, I think that's a lot of confidence going forward. Um, you know, I'm sure, <clears throat> you know, Tennessee's a good team. And, uh, they didn't play their best game by far. You know, I think our defense had something to do with it. But we didn't exactly play our A-plus game either. So I think there's a lot of growth, you know, for their team and our team probably. So our, team's, our team feels pretty good about it going forward. Paige is the kind of kid that if we do get her back sooner rather than later, uh, she doesn't care if she takes any shots. So that's one more distributor, one more – you know, smart decision maker, one more good defender, you know. Um, and, you know, Caroline will just keep being Caroline. That's her role. She's found her niche. She's found her role. Um, and then you can kind of play it by, by ear every game. You know, somebody's got it going, let's go with them, like AZ today. You know, another day it might be somebody else, you know. Um, you know, that was, the, that was the talk at practice on Friday. I said, you know, 
you watch any any good teams play, you know, pick up the paper. That guy had 35. That guy had 40 last night. That guy, why? They found a guy that can't be guarded, and just keep going to him, keep going to him, keep going to him. So you love to have a couple of those guys, not just one. You know, and uh, you know when you think about it, we really didn't get a great game from Kristen at all. Live, eh. So two two big pieces, Dorka. Huh? You know, so to win the way we did with not all the pieces functioning like you would like, you know, we could be good in March. Could be a good team in March. If we make the NCAA tournament, we're going to be a tough out.